I'm going to show you how to create a thumbnail for your tutorial videos on YouTube. Having an eye-catching thumbnail will help you get more views and also allow your students to see your lesson topics easily. So to do that, we will need to use a website called Canva. So go to search Canva on Google. And once you're in the website, you see that you can create an account by clicking sign up here, or you can just log in using your Google account. So I'm going to log in using my Google account. Okay, so once you log in using your Google account, you'll see that they will ask you to try Canva Pro for free. You don't need to sign up for the Pro because the free account already has a lot of templates to use. So just click skip Canva Pro for now. And once you're inside the website, you will see that you have a lot of templates here to use to create anything, but for this, video we are going to create youtube thumbnail so you can click it here if they show it in the recommended section or you can just click create a create a design by searching youtube thumbnail or if you already see that it's suggested just click here okay so you see that canva has a lot of templates to choose from to create your thumbnail since we're going to create lesson tutorial, let's see if we can find anything useful here. Okay, so I scroll down and I don't see anything that that's related to my lesson or anything I like. So I want to search a template that I would like to use for my lesson. So in the search bar, I'm going to search YouTube thumbnail, sorry, YouTube in outro. Or you can just search YouTube intro, you will also get a lot of images. Okay, so if I look at this part, I see a couple templates that I think are suitable for my lesson. This one looks pretty appealing, so I'm going to use this one. Now that we get the picture, we can enter our lesson topic by clicking the text on the left side. Okay, so we see that there are so many fonts to choose from. We want to pick something that's big and bold so it helps people to see our thumbnail easily. Remember, uh, when people see your thumbnail in, on YouTube, it's actually a very small picture, so you want something that stands out. Okay, so I'm going to pick maybe this one. All right, so let's just say you don't need everything in this text box. You see how when you move it, it uh, everything follows. You can actually delete certain part of this um, template. So to do that, you want to first select this text box and then you want to ungroup it. So let's say I just want the title, I don't want the heading. So I can just click the heading and then click delete. Okay, so now I have my title. I'm going to type my lesson topic. So for my next video, I want to talk about solving equation. Then you can just type how to solve equation, uh, one step equation, for example. And as you can see, this is too big. So you want to change the font size. So if we pick it, 32 is too small, so we can pick maybe a bigger number. Okay, so 88 looks like a pretty good size for me. So I'm going to keep this right here. You can also, if you're not satisfied with um, this font, you can also pick something else. There are so many options here on the left side. If you click this and then you see here, you can change it to other fonts as well. And I also want to type my name in the bottom. So I'm going to write Miss Zhang. 
Okay, so now that you are done creating your thumbnail, you can go to the top right corner, click the down arrow button, and then you can download. So um, they suggested you to download PNG mainly because that way you can get a high quality image. So I'm going to stick with that. If you do have the pro feature, you can also adjust um, certain features. You can get transparent background, but we don't need that right now. So I'm going to click download. Okay, so now we are done. We can just find our picture in the computer. So the next step is to show you how to add thumbnail to your YouTube video. Okay, so now I'm at the section where I upload a video. After you enter your title, you see that you can upload your thumbnail here. So I'm going to click upload and select the one that I just made on Canva. So the next part is to show you how to add thumbnail on iPad if you use iPad to create your video. Uh, you can do the same thing that you did on the desktop with the Canva app. Everything looks the same, so you don't have to worry about learning something new. After you're done with your thumbnail, you can just click the download button on the top right corner. And you will have the picture saved to your iPad. After you have the picture, you can go to YouTube Studio. Okay, so you want to find a video that you want to use, so we will just use the most recent one as example. Once you're on this page, you want to click the pencil symbol that's on the top right corner. And you can just click anywhere um, on this picture. And here you see that you have different um, selections for your thumbnail. You can either pick one that you like or you can um, you can click change and then you just um, insert a picture you want.